This is James Webb Space Telescope, an engineering marvel, an exploration powerhouse. Unlike Hubble, James Webb Space Telescope will not be serviceable during its mission. In order to either upgrade or repair Hubble throughout its nearly 20-year stint, several manned missions visited the telescope in space to carry out operations. However, Hubble orbits Earth at a measly 340 miles away. In comparison, JWST will orbit at just under 1 million miles out. James Webb Space Telescope will be four times farther from Earth than our Moon. As a result, no missions are currently planned to perform many service or repair operations on the telescope. JWST will be able to detect water on exoplanets. Today, we discover planets orbiting other stars by monitoring slight dips in the star's light as the planets pass in front of them. Furthermore, we can read unique signatures in the light, telling us a planet's chemical composition. JWST can clearly see a single penny 24 miles away. Sharpness of vision or angular resolution is everything for space telescopes, and JWST is no slouch in that department. In fact, the telescope could clearly see a penny from around 24 miles away. Put another way, JWST could clearly resolve a football from around 340 miles away. JWST will be folded up on its rocket and expand to its full size in space. James Webb Space Telescope's larger size makes the telescope a rather bulky payload to launch into space. Therefore, during launch, JWST will be folded, like origami, allowing it to fit into its compact space. Finally, once in space, the large telescope will unfold, expanding to its full size. One side of the telescope is hotter than Death Valley, the other side is colder than Antarctica. First, the side of JWST that will always face the sun will constantly sit at a scorching 85 degrees Celsius. In other words, one side of JWST will always be hotter than Death Valley. However, the other side, containing the mirrors and instruments, will constantly sit at a frigid minus 233 degrees Celsius. In other words, this side will always remain twice as cold as Antarctica. JWST launches far, far away from home. Launching an Anarian 5 rocket, provided by Europe, JWST will blast off from a European spaceport near French Guiana in South America. Plus, this launch location happens to be very close to the Earth's equator.
Simply put, the Earth spins considerably faster toward the equator. Ultimately, this increased spin will provide an additional, fuel-free boost for the Ariane 5 rocket carrying the telescope. The world's most reliable launch rocket and a free booster. Not bad. Let us know what you think about James Webb Space Telescope. Like and subscribe for more videos like this.